Hey, this is Mikey with another After Effects quick tip. Today we're going to be talking about the set matte effect. What the set matte effect is, is it's a lot like a track matte, but it's as an effect on your footage instead of using the track matte down here in your timeline. And what the advantage of that is, is it doesn't matter where the matte layer is. It could be anywhere in your stack and it'll still work because it's mapping to it from the set matte effect. So let's just go ahead and I'm going to just delete that. So what I have here is I have this text layer on top that says set matte. Then I have this animated shape layer. And then I even got another text layer at the bottom, but you can't see that yet. So if we go to this top text layer, let's go to effect, channel, set matte. And this is basically adding like a track matte effect. But again, it's in these, these effects controls. So if I come to take matte from layer and I switch that to this matte layer, well then now as it moves up, it's going to matte out that top one. I've got this bottom text on. It's going to matte out that top one to reveal transparency below it where I can put in this bottom text layer. Now because of this, I can put this these layers anywhere. I can have multiple layers and I have this matte layer, I can put it anywhere and it's still going to work because it's mapping to it, again, through the effect. So that's the difference between set matte and a track matte. So very handy if you need it. Um, if you have any questions, feel free to ask. Just put them in the comments below. Also, if you have any tutorial suggestions, I love taking suggestions. Just put those down in the comments below as well. Thank you so much for watching and we'll see you next time.